Welcome back to Ask a Plant Doctor, the plant doctor from WSU Spokane uh, Master Gardener Program, Tim Kohov, the expert of all experts. Oh. The plant doctor <laughs> is making a house call at Hiroko Hills Garden. Now, Hiroko, you have some question for the plant doctor. Yes, mm -hmm. I do. So this is uh, my um, tomato plant, and uh, it is called Bull's Heart. And, Bull's uh, Heart. What mm -hmm. a beautiful name. Well, I understand it's get big and looks like a heart shape, but look at the leaves. Oh, oh yeah. So the leaves are kind of curling up yeah. along the along Doesn't the look edges. Doesn't look healthy to me. Right. I see what you're saying. And sometimes when we see leaves do this, it can be the sign of a problem. Mm -hmm. There are different causes that that might uh, create this symptom in a plant. I'm looking at your plant as a whole, and it's got lots of really good looking tomato fruit on okay. it. And the plant itself is a nice size. I think that this is what's called physiological leaf roll, mm -hmm. which is a 10 cent word that just means the leaves are curling up because of the weather. Mm. Too and hot? So, too hot. Sometimes this happens when it's too cold. Sometimes if it shifts from hot to cold or cold to hot, this happens. But uh, but all it means is that the tomato is reacting to the weather that's outside. Does it mean that it's stress? It might be the sign of a little stress, but most of the time there isn't any impact on the production of tomatoes. And so you'll still get lots of healthy big tomatoes from a plant that does this. It's just this plant seems to be reacting a little bit to, it could be the temperature, it could be uh, something that's going on in the soil, but in general, I think this is a pretty healthy plant. Mm, okay. Do and you think I should water this plant more? Well, um, water it about the same as, as the other tomatoes, and that's a good baseline. And then if you want to water more, that might help it adapt to, the, to, to whatever is causing this. Uh, sometimes when we see these leaves curling like that, it's a sign that there's some herbicide in the oh. area. But you're an organic gardener, I think, mm -hmm. you told us. So, mm -hmm. so there's no herbicide here. Uh, and sometimes uh, when leaves curl like that, the top of the plant gets very stunted mm -hmm. and it's called curly top virus. This doesn't have a virus. This is a really healthy looking oh, tomato you. plant. So I think that uh, you might try a little bit more water just to see if that if that helps, um, but overall, even though it looks it looks like it's a little stressed, I bet this is going to produce lots of really healthy tomatoes. But does a uh, if I water more, mm -hmm. does leaf go back to normal, or is it going to be curled? So I would say it'll show in the newest growth. Uh, so the new growth won't be curled. Okay. This might always be a little bit curled. But if it's happy, then the new growth that comes out will will be flat. So that's a sign. Yeah. Okay. So you're saying that the top growth is always your indicator of the overall health of the plant. Yes, and I would say with a little star next to it, because sometimes there are some leaf diseases that start at the bottom of the plant where there's lots of humidity and, and work their way up. So, so the top growth is very important, but you want to look at the whole Plant to make sure it's healthy. So uh, I know that this is not the first time we have been asked that question regarding the leaf curls on the tomato. So for all of you gardeners out there, I think Tim's message is look at the overall plant mm -hmm. uh, health, but um, a little bit of stress at this time of the year for the tomato is quite reasonable, right? Right. If I was standing out yeah. in a field and it was 100 degrees, I'd be a little stressed too. <laughs> I just wouldn't stand out there, period. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for watching. Hit like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And thank you, Hiroko, for asking good questions. Oh. And this is Jian Jian for Spoken Public Library Home and Garden Channel.